this uh, today at CNN, Bob Green, an author who has written a book about a love story, who now is an expert in love, says that Prince Charles should rule uh, or become king for one day, and then let uh, William become king. Now, I must give you a backdrop at CNN. CNN seemed to have something going on with uh, the New World Order, and also they seem to have a whole bunch of Eastern religion involved at CNN. Is why they have a lot of people from India working there, and um, uh, they, they seem to have different opinions in the organization. This is good. For example, they think that uh, Obama should go to uh, Libya and do whatever and, and uh, keep up the stupidness, and then of course they can come back and see how the economy is based. But you know, so you don't know where CNN stands. I mean, there, but ratings, okay. Now, I'm from the British Empire. He's not. And we British people believe that Charles is more qualified to be king than William. He just has to wait. Just as how Charles is waiting on his mom, he has to wait. Now, if they think that Charles is fickle, as one guy says, you, what do you think about William? William's a young boy. He doesn't have no experience. What does he know? I mean, look, we become the head of the Commonwealth. People from around the world come for your opinion. What opinion William has? Suppose now tomorrow there's a, a, a situation in Britain. And um, Cam uh, Cameron decides to call in William. We need some advice here. What well, he's going to say? He has to depend on advisors more than Charles. Charles has lived, he has seen different things work, and so on. And um, his experience is important. So I think that uh, basically um, anybody who is writing a lot on William, and the more people start to clamor for William to be king, is the more I'm getting suspicious, and the more it's becoming as if the, <laughs> the monarchy is going to end right now. Because, I mean, he's not proven. Yes, well, Charles has had a marriage that went through in the whole nine hours of his romance, but that has nothing to do with Charles. Charles is to be king. And uh, if they keep pushing this, I mean, just write off the monarchy, because I think that, uh, um, I know they're having changes coming on now where it's going to be firstborn, and the religion is not important. But there's no law about succession. Charles is the one who should succeed. And as I say, that anytime you start talking in terms of skipping and William is this big king and all that, I know that it's going to come to an end because his marriage is not tested. He's not married yet. Let, let us give him a chance. Let us see if it's all going to work. I mean, look, the history is that all these young people know the marriages don't work. So, well, Charles' own didn't work. His own, would it work? I mean, who knows? So, um, and perhaps if he's king and then he has all these marital problems, I mean, what's going to happen? So, I think that CNN basically seemed to be uh, submerged in Eastern culture and very uh, imperceptibly they're looking for a paradigm shift without even recognizing it. And what they might get is um, they want the monarchy to go. Anybody with these Eastern stuff and these old time views, they don't like the monarchy. They want it to go. And while they might seem to be saying, yeah, we want your, uh, William, he's a good man, deep down in the heart, they want the monarchy to end. And they know that if they put in this young man and put everything on him, put the whole world, the whole monarchy in him, and he's going to fail, it's like it's over. And I'm saying that Britannia and the monarchy are more important than Charles, William, and the Queen. All of them put together. It's, it's an institution. And um, so I think that if, Char if William can't wait, and these people are reflecting his, on, uh, his body language that he wants to be king tomorrow, I think we're in for some serious problems in the Commonwealth. And as I said, he doesn't have the experiences yet. His father has more experience. His father's in line. And uh, he, he, he's supposed to be after Charles. Charles ruled until he feel like he had enough. No no law should say, oh yeah, you have just a year or six months or whatever. He ruled. And when he decides to uh, step down, he steps down. So I think that this guy, uh, Green at, at CNN, he needs to mind his own business and um, don't get involved in Commonwealth stuff because this is Commonwealth Affairs. He's not a member of the Commonwealth.